Hello, Eatonville Google Voice users. I got a request here today from Alex Van Steen on how do you put names to numbers in Google Voice? How do you add them to your contact roster? So I wanted to show you guys today how that was going to work. So I'll show you a quick picture. This is what Alex Van Steen showed me. If you look on the left-hand side over here, you'll notice that a lot of these individuals, there's just no name associated with it. So he was wondering, how do I show a name for the number? I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. So I'm assuming you guys are in your Google Voice here. Now, if you go up to the calls, and you might have some calls in here from numbers you don't recognize. So say, for instance, this number right here. It's, I don't have a name associated with it. Easiest way to do this, if you click on it, it'll pull up a tab right here in the middle of the page. And in the top right-hand corner, you'll see the three icons for the more options. You click on that. Then you have people. You click on that one again. And then you get this option right here. And this little icon on the right where it says add to context. You want to click that guy right there. And this is the opportunity where you can type in the name and you can add a label to it as well. Now, a label might be really helpful if you want to categorize uh, parents into certain areas. So say, for instance, you want to put all your first period parents in a certain label. That'd be a great way to put it. Think of it like file folders. Um, so you might do like first period parents, and put them all on that label. And then you do second period parents, put them all on that label. So food for thought. Once you've done that, you click the add button and you're done. So hopefully this helps you guys organize and get your guys' numbers a little more lined up and I'll get you guys where you need to be with Google Voice. Hope you guys are having a good day and enjoy this weekend coming up. Thank you. Bye.